Hi guys, welcome back to another vlog. I thought I'd vlog today because I'm doing a couple of fun things around Seattle today. So I thought I would take you guys along with me. First, I am trying to go to a really popular bakery that sells these really yummy viral donuts that I see all over my For You page. They're basically like these super fluffy donuts and they have like different creams inside. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen them and there's a place in Seattle called Flower Box that sells them and they're always sold out and they get there super early. So we're trying to get there like 30 minutes early and hopefully the line's only like 40 minutes to an hour. I hear if you don't go early, then you have to be like two hours in line and by the time you're up there, all the donuts are sold out. So I really want to try them today. And they're also kind of like crumble cookies where their flavors change every like two weeks, couple weeks. So that's super exciting. And I saw the menu this week and it looked really good. And then also I might go to a little landmark that has a waterfall. And I will take you guys along with me. But I thought I would start the vlog. Also wanted to show you guys my outfit for today everything is from aritzia the crop jacket is the tna cropped boyfriend jacket one piece is the wilfred free divinity romper seven inch and it's in black and i'm just gonna be wearing some vans and my hair's up because it's super freaking hot today but i always have to bring a jacket with me because i literally get cold everywhere so yeah that is the little outfit of the day each other's playlists no no we used to be each other's best friends yeah and now we go our separate pathways but your heart's still in mind yeah and maybe we could try it next week again but i don't want to think what's toxic salted caramel coffee and blueberry cheesecake and they look so good and I'm so excited to try them and then we also got a strawberry milk which is seasonal and apparently a fan favorite and then also a mocha coffee so I am so excited for this I just left that flower box place and I filmed so many good clips. It was so good. I definitely give it overall like an 8.5 out of 10. The flavors were really good this week. We came on a really good week. It ended up being a one hour wait, which I don't think is horrible. We got there 30 minutes earlier before open time, which was 10 o'clock. But I feel like if it was like a two hour wait, um, I probably wouldn't have done it. 
but if you're like really into sweets you really like donuts and it's maybe worth it to you but it wasn't that bad of a wait and it was really really good i also got the strawberry milk and i already finished it it was so good that it was seasonal that it was a customer favorite it was the employee's favorite too so i really recommend the strawberry milk and the flavors change every week the favorite one was the vanilla bean the vanilla bean one was so good it kind of tasted like custard and it wasn't overly sweet it was so creamy and the donuts were like fried perfectly and not too much sugar around them my fiance and i just split them and we have a couple left and we'll finish them today because they recommend that you don't um save them or eat them within a couple of days because there's no bad stuff in the donuts like there's no preservatives there's no like just it's all like natural so you want to eat it as fresh as possible so definitely gonna finish those today but we have made our way to snoqualmie falls here in washington it's like 30 minutes away outside of Seattle and they have like a small little hike to get to this really beautiful famous waterfall so I'm really excited about that because it's a beautiful weather today and it's not super hot but the sun's out and the skies are blue with a little bit of clouds it's just such a nice day and such a pretty Sunday so, so yeah I have my SPF on and I have a little jacket to cover like my arms from getting like burnt or anything like that I've seen waterfalls in Hawaii when I went a couple years ago but somewhere that's like 30 minutes away from like where I live and that's super cool which is why i love washington just because of all the nature greenery waterfalls mountains that they have i think it's so cool it's only 30 minutes out and you could see a waterfall so i've seen photos so hopefully it lives up to the hype so let's go outside and I stopped at Sephora earlier and I want to show you guys what I picked up so I just got one thing and it's from Patrick Ta this is a brush actually and it's called the precision sculpting brush and I guess the specific name is called for contour 3 and I've heard a lot of people talk about this for nose contouring so I really wanted it to give it a try. I've actually, I hardly buy brushes from certain companies. I usually just buy like a big pack from like Sephora or I have a couple of Sephora brushes and Morphe brushes that are like old. But I hardly buy brushes that are like specific brushes from companies that make sense. Like an Anastasia brush, a Patrick Ta brush. I usually don't do that. Um, I have an hourglass brush that's really good, but I haven't gotten a brush in a very long time so yeah i'm really excited i'll let you guys know how i like it but this is what it looks like it's dual sided which is really cool this is what it looks like um it basically has one side that is tapered so this is the part where you do your nose contouring and then the other side is a big old fluffy brush that you can use to blend out your contour or your nose contour that you just did so super cool and it's so pretty it's like this like silvery rose gold um packaging so cute it says you can also apply both cream and powder to sculpt and shape the nose so that's super cool i have a little contour nose brush but it's so old honestly i need a new one 
So I'm really glad that I picked this up. And then basically after um, I shopped a little at Sephora, I had a very, very late lunch, early dinner. So I think I'm only gonna have one meal today. Um, it just worked out like that sometimes. So yeah, it was really good. It was at this little Taiwanese restaurant that I like a lot that's in downtown Seattle. So it was super good. I think for the rest of the day Sunday, I'm just gonna chill, clean up the apartment a little. Um, dust, vacuum, all that stuff and just take it easy. Tonight I'm going to walk my dog. The weather is just so good at night and the sun doesn't set till like 9 o'clock, 9.30 even. So it's so nice. So I think I'm going to walk my dog later, but I just wanted to check in.